Hello friendly skeptic, practitioner here. Once again, I have to make a slight point about the $1 million challenge and the reason why it's not the best mechanism available yet for testing for psychic phenomena and I would personally prefer a test done by the Skeptic Society um, under run by Michael Shermer. Um, first things first, James Randi's um, so-called dealing with the negative vibrations. It doesn't matter if they exist or not. The point is that when Randy tries to leave in order to deal, in order to make sure his skepticism doesn't unduly affect the test, or um, the problem is that there's still other skeptics present. And as I've pointed out in Experimenter Psi Effect Final Data, there is so something called the Experimenter Bias, where both believers and skeptics, if they um, might inadvertently cause claimants to uh, confirm their expectations. Since uh, claimants know they are being tested by a skeptical organization, psychological effect would dictate. Anywho, I've already made propositions as to how this could be amended. Um, see my videos, a look into the psychic update and experimental side effect. James Randi blew me off. Um, so, like I said, 